Hello, you awesome people out there. My name is Akira, and welcome back to this let's play of Pokemon Black Nuzlocke. So, I have been um, grinding a little since last time because I thought I was not strong enough. And uh, Pokedex was not what I was going for, but um, Pokemon. So, I have um, leveled all my Pokemon to level 30, and that means that the um, uh, Tynamo thing, thing, I can't remember its name now. Temple um, has evolved and is now a Palpitoad. Um, so that's some of the only changes. And then the, I learned some attacks on the way, but I'll not go too much into detail with that because that is taking too long then. So, but my plan is for this display, this, uh, this episode, uh, to see if I can find the last answer I am missing somewhere in the city. I have no freaking idea where he is. Uh, I know he's not inside the Pokemon Center because I kind of started in the Pokemon Center when I first started grinding. Um, I don't want to take the ship because that can only go horribly, horribly, horribly wrong. Um, but I'm checking all the harbors first to see if the last dancer should be here. And nope. I really have no idea where he is, so. But I know I have to find three of them, and I found two last time. God dang it, girl. <laughs> Don't go in front of me. But yeah, I found two of them last time. He is there. Great. What do you want? Oh, I'm... The dancer team. You're going to introduce me to the team. Oh, then before that, let's have a Pokemon battle. Okay. So, and uh, order that my Pokemon is... In now it's the same as last time because I tried not to change too much around um, on that because I actually like to have my Sork as my first choice. So and yeah, my Sork has not has not learned any new attacks, so it's the same as last time. And was that a yawn? I hope not. Don't want to sleep. Ah, there we go. But I should be pretty good in the... I am strong department. I hope. And we got the last answer, so now up to them. Um, but yeah, also in... Um, what's it called? In the news about... Um, what's it called? Uh, the question of the video, I did not get any answers this time around, sadly enough. So, yeah. I, I, I think I will keep the question from last time because of that. And if I'm not mistaken, the question was, uh, what is your favorite legendary Pokemon? Um, so, please answer it down in the comments below and tag it with the QOTB before. Do so. Thanks, man. I got the best team in the world here. That's how I feel. And I got an amulet. Co oh, amulet coin. That's actually a pretty neat item to get because um, it does so that my when I defeat a trainer, I get more money from it. Of course, if I equipped it. <laughs> so, but I have no plan of doing so at the moment. I don't know why, but. I uh, really not that good at encrypting <laughs> encrypting things. Yanka, hello, Takira. You remember the <laughs> you remember the promise you made on the X transceiver? God, I don't know why I can't pronounce that word. X transceiver, right? So let's get right to our Pokemon battle. But before that. They said we can have a Pokemon battle in the gate as long as we're careful not to break the electronic billboard. In the new and improved version of me, it's going to be great this time. Let's start up our Pokemon battle again. Well, let's see if we destroy everything this time around too.
So she has a uh, Harlier. It's always hard pronouncing the names of the Pokemon wrong. <laughs> I'm not that good at pronouncing the words. Uh, so I will try my best to pronounce them correctly, but if I am mispronouncing some things, then sorry about it. Okay, as you. Well, okay, it was critical hit. I was just about how the hell did it do so much damage? And I hope you don't do that again because I don't want to miss my bird. Miss? Lose my bird. My tweety tweety. My little swanky. I'm Muna. Alright, she has Muna. Um, but. Uh, Muna is psychic, right? I think. Dark type attack does more damage to. Oh, we can just do a Tront. Uh, that was my mistake. That's <laughs> not what I was planning to do. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I did. I didn't read what the attack was. So come on, so you can drive that thing. Fine, oh. And you should be down now. Then she has. I think it's. Pick oh, yeah, pick night. So you have evolved your Pokemon, I say. But I have also evolved mine, and it was super effective. Why was that super effective? Pinkleg is fire only, isn't it? No, I'm not sure. Why the hell is that super? I, I have no idea why. And how many super potions do we have, girl? Really? <laughs> Stop that. Which one was more? And again, this time don't heal. Thank you. But yeah, Pig is Pig Knight not only fire or is it also fighting? No, I can't remember. Because if it's fighting, then yeah, then it should be weak against my. Sorry for that pants there. And down it goes. Now I have to check the Pokedex. I really want to know what the type Pit Knight is. I hope I can see it in the Pokedex. I'll never be a strong trainer like you and Charon. Or Iris. But, you know, since we live never. <sighs> New of Town. I met a lot of people and I've been thinking about what I want to do in life. When you look at it this way, Pokemon have given me a lot of new experiences. Having my Pokemon story was just really hot and I feel really unsure. Still, I gotta say, I'm really glad I went. I learned so much on this journey and I also learned that being with Pokemon is really really important. Okay, well, I hope you see you again soon. Bye bye, Jakira. Okay. So, Pick Knight. What type is Pick Knight? Get down there, please. Pick Knight. There, can I see what type it is? Nope. I have no idea what. I, I think it it must be firefighting. I'm not sure though. And I just realized that my dosing machine is not on. There we go. Oh, talk to you. Route 4 is the long. Be careful if you plan to follow it. Okay, if it's long way, then I will go down heal Pokemon. Like a champ. <laughs> uh, or a chicken. But I. My, my, my bird got a lot of damage on this um, <laughs> one attack that actually hit me. So, I and I, I really don't. I, I don't feel like losing it. That line is still long. I really don't know if I actually can get past that line. I can't remember it. I think I can uh, to get the ice cream thing, but I'm not sure at all now, so. But yeah, I, I feel like I'm talking a lot here, <laughs> rambling. But okay, I'm talking about the game, so let's second start. <laughs> and 
There we go. So uh, also when I was grinding, I did not grind up uh, the Pokemon in my boxes. So there's still load level. I, I think I have a two or three Pokemon in there. I can't remember. I know I have the uh, Wubat. Um, but I can't actually remember what else I have in there. Of course I have the Pokemon that are lost, but I really don't count that anymore, but yeah. I'm still missing it. Like, I lost it so easy, that was just stupid. And what's up with all those clean trash cans, really? Welp. Oh, my first encounter on this road. And it's a uh, sand isle. Okay, I'm a way over leveled here. Oh god. I really hope that I can do this without killing it. Oh, and there's a sandstorm going in the gust. Please. Don't kill it. Okay, that should be fine. Ah! You throw sand at me? More sand. Okay, so back. Uh, pool balls. I still have heal balls, but I think I would use a great. Just as long as I have balls to use, then everything should be a okay. There we go. We got a sand dial. And sand dial shall be named. They live buried in the sand of the desert. The sun warm sand prevents the body temperature from dropping. So this is ground dark, I think it was. Give an ignite to sand dial, of course. And my sand dials will be named. Snappy! Snappy the sand dial. And Snappy was sent to the PC. Bye bye, Snappy. I really don't know how many special items there is around here. Oh, a trainer! Take a look at the sand. Do you see how some areas are lighter and some of the sand looks darker? Pokemon are hiding in the darker sand. And I have just talked to you about that. Uh, and Karen is there, so I will go this way. First off, there's an item over there, okay. What? Are you worn out? Okay, I rest here for a minute. Okay, so I have a resting place here. That's nice. And another empty trash can. What's up with all those empty trash cans? I don't know if I have to go this way though. Um, there seems to be an item down here somewhere. There we go. It's a pearl. Then we just need a diamond. Okay, good catch, good catch. My next catch will be challenge victory. At least it didn't say the next, my next catch will be you. Also, that has been kind of um, weird if you did that. Thinking of that, if I played as a guy. I really don't like the sandstorm. So... Isn't there something about this one giving damage by physical attacks? Wow. Oh right, that's uh, first attack attack. <laughs> that's not real, a first attack attack. Uh, but it has a high speed, so it attacks first in comparison to what I used. And I got hit by the sandstorm again, and there's another of them. So, let's see if we can get this one down quick. You bite me! <laughs> All that sandstorm. Oops, not the, <laughs> my plan to use that attack. Okay, but it works, so I'm okay with that. And again, as... Holy crap, how many hats does he have of them? <laughs> it's a new magic cap. Uh, the only uh, difference is that this one actually can give damage. So, but um, yeah, also, as I said before, if you want me to record the grinding montages instead of just um, skipping them like I do, 
Uh, please tell me in the comments down below also, of course. I don't want to skip them if you actually want to see them. I know they can be tedious, sometimes that's why I don't show them now, but... If you want to see them, I can of course um, put them in, speed them up, and make like the first five minutes my grinding montage if you want to see it. So, but that's totally up to you, so... But um, yeah, I, I would probably say that every single time I play this game, of course. I really... <sighs> attack, not attack. Uh, maybe heal. How much does this give me? Uh, potion gives 20 health. I think that can do it. Yeah, I, I should be good now. Hopefully. Unless he does a critical attack, please don't do that. Nope, no more healing. Just um, quick attack. It. That's not good of me, actually. Okay, it didn't have the... Um, heart thing, thing where they, it gives me damage when it hits me. And what's the easiest way to the house from here? This way around? It's not that I don't want to go in the high cross, I always, almost said. It's more like I want to heal up. I would rather heal up a lot than run out and die, so... And yeah, I also have noticed that I don't actually use um, many of my Pokemon when I fight this game, but... Um, I have a tendency when I play Pokemon actually only using one Pokemon all the time. Um, so when I level up, it's just when I come to a really hard battle where I have to switch up sometimes in battle that I actually make sure that I have strong Pokemon with me. Um, also, if I'm going to lose one in a battle, it's, it's not good only to have that one Pokemon. So I make sure to have a lot of Pokemon with me uh, that is high leveled. But using many of them, I actually don't do normally. Not that even when I play for myself. The only reason I use other Pokemon than my first is actually when someone uh, faints in the game. So... Oh right, he had two of them. I hope he has two only. Or else this would take forever again. So, but yeah. So... Uh, you will probably see Sork uh, fight a lot in this let's play of uh, Pokemon because of me not switching out that much. Uh, but again, I also think that Sork actually has um, evolution more to come. I think it's a, two, uh, a three stage uh, a three stage Pokemon. Uh, there's an item there. A Great Ball. Nice. We can never have too many Great Balls. Don't take that out of context. And an Ultra Ball. Nice. So, but I think this is just a detour I'm on right now. Um, because uh, Sh uh, Sharon was down. Oh, I, that one. It actually pretty nice Pokemon. I think when its health is down, uh, the evolution of it is health is down. Um, so I think it's red, then it changes um, appearances. I, I think it's that one that does it. But yeah, that was easy to defeat. Hello! I can see up ahead because of the sandstorm. Because I can see I have a battle with you. That logic. <laughs> okay then. Bring it all, girl. Let's see what you got. No, uh, a temple. I also have a temple. A ten. A temple. So let's see how well that will do against my air cutter. Very good, I think, because it's water ground. No. I think it's ground or it's water rock. Now I'm actually not sure anymore. Either way, it's down. <laughs> Ow. That's sandstorm. 
It's going to be my death. Eggarder! So close to a one shot. God dang it. No, 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 not in this episode, I know it's not the second time in this episode, but it's the second time this playthrough I get down to one health. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> What's too close to comfort? Oh, for comfort they called. I want that one. And Hyper Potion. I'll see. I cannot get around there, so... Do you want to fight? My way of life is dynamic. Well, okay. If you say so. Worker got sent out. A rock and roller. I actually think you have uh, advances against me here because I'm a bird. And you're a rock. Okay, it was because it was critical. I was just like, holy crap, how did I do that much damage? But. Crit. <laughs> Crit does a lot of damage. Okay, so he still has some Pokemon. He has Temper! I think that is actually a fighting type, so it will be down pretty insane. There we go. I actually have no idea why fighting types are weak against um, birth attacks. I'm really curious to find out why. God dang it! Use less used item. And we are good to continue. Rock Blast! Uh, please stop that. Like, stop. Thank you. Well, I just heal again then. Oh crap, that attack does a lot of damage. Stop. I really don't like that attack. Stop it! Okay. Now you've done it. Go, Jack. Oh, Jack is actually quite um, close to evolve once more. I think it's level 20, uh, 32 or 34 it evolves on. A lot better. Now it doesn't do that much damage to me anymore. Water gun! There we go. Okay, I actually think, even though I just for some seconds ago said that I have a tendency not to switch Pokemon out, then I think I actually will switch Pokemon out. Um, and then I have to use this one again. Um, I have to get up over there, so I have to get around here. Fight this thing, whatever it is. Another one of the Runaka, I think. The Runaka. The Runaka. The Runaka. I can't see if it is an N or an M. I think it's an M. The Runaka. I think that's what it's called. But I'm pretty sure that some people will correct me in the comments down below and say you must pronounce it wrong or something like that. <laughs> so. Uh, anything of interest? A burn heal. If my Pokemon ever should burn. An Aether. But yeah, it looks like this is just a decoy. Decoy. 
detour. <laughs> decoy. <laughs> a detour that I'm on right now, so... I have to go down and fight... I, I think I have to fight Charon. Um, and I can heal on the way that back there, so... That's a burr! Go Jack! And raise your shield. Well, that was easy. <laughs> uh, it could have been better bird. It's okay. And let's get this one. Torment. I'm finding all them attacks. And I'm finding all them Pokemon. But I've always kept the Pokemon here. And I totally forgot to make a list of which areas I actually have cast Pokemon in. I'm not too good at remembering stuff like that, so... I really hope that... I think I think I'll make the list to next time then, so I can keep track of it. So yeah, <sighs> really. Okay, the room. Oh, I have a really good name for my toast uh, to diet. Um, Sand I just got actually. I should have called it the root. Well, <sighs> sometimes you just don't get the puns. Um, not where I wanted to go, but okay. Around here and down, and we have been up there, so there should be nothing and. Heal, and then I went talk to Sharon, and hope he doesn't destroy my voice. Um, my voice is still a little not good, so it can happen. So, but um, let's try. Hey, Takira, it's been I've been waiting for you to get the uh, insect batch. And now it's time to see which one of us is the strongest trainer. Me, of course. Duh. I'm going to be the champ one day. And you're just going to be a gym leader. Duh. <laughs> Actually, I think he is a gym leader in Black and White 2. <laughs> so yeah, he's going to be a gym leader. I can foretell you your destiny. But until then, um... I will work on your bird. And Pigeon failed. And I got hit by the root sandstorm. Alright. Um, isn't there something that grass don't like bug type attacks? And I don't like deep seed. So now we're even. Uh, it's super effective, but not that effective. But okay, I will give you that's actually a good counter for the sandstorm that you can heal using me as your healing thing. So let's see. Growth. Your attack is up. I will cut you down. Uh, I have a feeling that you're stronger than me. And you had a berry. God dang it. And your seed. I'm sorry about that. As I said, I'm still a little sick, so... Um, I think I will switch out to Sork. Hopefully Sork can. Leave Tornado! And my Curse fell. God dang it. Air Cutter! It survived that. But I actually think it will die because of the sandstorm now, so that's okay. Pamper! That should be okay. I'm not afraid of you. Not the slightest. 
and I don't take any chances. Or maybe I do. I didn't hit you. Quick attack! But yeah, right, my accuracy is down. And level 32. Ooh, air cut. Air, air, air slash. I actually want air slash instead of taunt, because it's taunt, I can't use that for anything. So, air slash. And I got hit by the root sandstorm again. <laughs> I miss my Batman. Mm, air slash. We are in the desert. There's a stance on going. You don't have to throw sand in my face too. Okay, I will try once more and then I have to switch out. And that is why I had to switch out. Pokemon, which one will I send out? I think I will take Jack again because Jack is close to a level and also to a, to a evolving, so he deserves it. Torment. Um, just a water gun. <laughs> that did nothing at all. And you're down. Ooh, it is evolving. I knew it had one more. No, he's so cute. Congratulations, your shark evolved into Unpheasant. Pheasant. Pheasant. Unpheasant. It's now clear to me. The reason you are so tough is the trust between you and your Pokemon. But that shouldn't be a problem. I can get more out of Snipe. Uh, Sabine. Sabine? And my other Pokemon too. And my phone is ringing. Takira picked up the X transceiver. Hello there. Takira, do I have a second? Professor Juniper, do you need something? I called Bianca too, but I guess she didn't hear the call. I wonder what she called up in. Well, I suppose I'll just have to call her again later. Okay, I'll be waiting for you two in front of the gate of Nimbasa City. Um, hello? Uh, hello? You better see this gate is straight down room 4. I think I will go heal first though. Oh, I will take this battle! <laughs> so, but... I have a rough son! And it's a female! Because I think the male actually has those pretty long things on the head. So, let's just work on you. You should not be able to survive that. I think. Maybe? <laughs> okay, you're down. Okay. So, Healy Healy and then on to the next city. Let's see what Professor Juniper wants from me. Of course, she wants something. Also, make sure that deep in the desert ahead of here, uh, at the desert resort, there is some rooms that have become a little tourist attraction. Okay, uh, for some reason, I will see if I can get around all the trainers in some facility manner. Are you a bitch? No, but you are. <laughs> I'm sorry for calling her a bitch, but some trainers have a tendency to just turn around when you pass. Uh, rock through them, so rock through them. Walk past them. <laughs> Don't walk through other trainers. That's the stupid. <laughs> Why did I say walk through? Or oh, is it a walk through? 
Hmm, interesting. No, not really. What? I want that. And Super Potion. Can I get past you? No, he's one of those bitchy terrain that turns around when you try to get past him. The fun of traveling around the world is having serious battles with a lot of Pokemon I met. So, but yeah, I think I can actually grind in this area next time because I kind of run past a lot of trainers, <laughs> but again, if I fight every single trainer that I see, it will take forever to get past this and uh, get through this game, so I'm just realizing that that one is uh, an electric Pokemon. But yeah, um, it will take forever for me to uh, complete the game if I have to fight every single train I see, so that's why you will see me. When I look at the freeway, it feels exciting. That's why you will see me past, uh, pass through some areas without fighting every train, of course. I can take them in a grinding instead of um, fighting them now, because, yeah, time. So. You have a pillow. I have a jack. Who has the strongest? So yeah, but um, I hope that's okay with you guys. I, I think it will be because it will be kind of tedious and boring to just watch me battle, battle, battle so many trainers on the way to uh, the goal of the game. Yeah. You ha of course you will see the important battles, um, that's, they're not tedious at all, that, they're important, but it's all the small battles with um, random encounters, trainer that I will get that can be kind of boring to watch. So let's see what um, Professor Juniper wants. Hello Takira. Come here. Okay, okay. Elisa called and was asking me all about electric type Pokemon. And I thought about you guys. That's why I wanted you uh, uh, to see you. Ta-da! Freebies for you. Here, Jaren. You too, Takira. Takira obtained an Ultra Ball. Thank you. If you see a Pokemon that you want to have uh, to have join you, be sure to use a good type of Pokeball, because that could be the first and last time you see that Pokemon. I know it might seem strange for me to say this, since I'm the one who asked you to complete the Pokedex, but please, remember to enjoy your journey. Of course, I'm not saying you and <laughs> you can't just neglect the Pokedex, but you know that. Now if you'll please excuse me, I have to go meet Bianca. So you want to tell us about that Elizabeth asked you about Electro-type Pokemon and give us a Pokeball. Or an Ultra Ball in this case. Since the professor gave us a Pokedex as a reason to send us on a journey, or get rid of us. At least that's what my mom told me. They wanted us to go out and <laughs> they wanted us to go out and see the world. So my mom, Bianca's mom, and your mom made a request to Professor Juniper. Takira, what would we do now? What we should we do now? I think I'd like to show the professor my thanks by going to Route 4 and catching some Pokemon I haven't yet met yet. Okay, goodbye. I think I will go to the next um, city. Look at the electric... Uh, I don't. And again, an empty trash can. God dang it. So this is the next city. Grams! You know the one of the daytime. I really hope that's a male, or else he has a, or else he has a really weird voice. And I actually think it's female. How do we know? Because we're Team Plasma. Team Plasma, <laughs> we're taking Pokemon away from people. Since you work at the daycare, we figured you must have a lot of Pokemon. Hand them over. What? What kind of nonsense is this? Oh, a strong looking trainer. Please help me. If you're going to get 
uh, get in our way. We'll make, we'll take your Pokemon too. I really hope those, I, I, I don't, it's a female or male. I'm not sure. Sometimes it's hard to see on the pixel. Okay, it's males. Welp, then I was right the first time around. But sometimes it's hard to see on the pixel art that actually male or female. It, it's getting, it's better in um, X and Y and Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire because there you can actually see it on the on their sprite because they're not sprites in what they're kind of chibi things now. So a lot easier to see what they are. Wow, you from your door at me? Literally, it it, it is a uh, trash Pokemon, and I'm level thirty one. So, do the other one want to fight me too? This went downhill fast, so I think we better one. Let's hide out in the amusement park. Boop, 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 boop. Thank you so much. Please take this as a token of gratitude. It's a brand new bike. I always plan on riding around Nimbo City, uh, but I never ended up riding it. Down in the backpack with that. I have a day care on Route 3. If you have any Pokemon you want me to raise, please drop them off. I just came to sightseeing, but I got a lot of trouble. Well, you can say that. Takira! Now what? The professor told me Nimble City has a lot of things to see and do. The amusement park, big stadium, small court, and a battle subway. I'm going to see the Pokemon musical. See you later. Uh, okay. Bye bye. Bianca makes a random encounter. So I will go to the Pokemon Center. <laughs> okay. Nothing of interest and I'll just heal up here. So my Pokemon is kind of strong for this um, area, so that's good. So yeah, I think I will end this episode here also to um, have a little mercy on my throat. It still hurts a little when I talk, so... Um, but yeah, I hope I will be back to normal very, very, very soon uh, with my voice. So because I really love making Let's Plays for you guys and <laughs> so irritating when, I, uh, when I'm sick and my throat hurts when I talk. So, but yeah, but... Um, that's um, it for this time then, so please again remember to answer the question of the video down in the comments below and tag it with the QOTV um, and I will um, pronounce it, I will showcast it the next time on the screen so everyone can see what you have answered. And yeah, also if you want me to, again to showcast the uh, grinding montages, uh, please tell me also that I can put them in. And I think that is it. So I hope you enjoyed this episode. You can give it a thumb up if you did. You can hit me up on Facebook or Twitter or write a comment down below. You can subscribe for more awesome videos. And I hope you all will have an awesome day. So until next time, farewell.